um, manager of England and these revelations from uh, the Daily Telegraph, they continue tonight, I believe there's more allegations about managers in, in the championship, but let, let's, just, let's just deal with, with Sam Allardyce and, and Liam, um, just give me your take on all of this. Some quotes today, well, uh, one of the papers in England, English football's lowest ebb, uh, Alan Shearer, England are a laughing stock of world football. Like, where does all of this stuff sit with you? Allardyce is gone, Southgate is in, and, and these, how damaging are all of these, these allegations that, that are out there now, and more coming? Well, first of all, on Sam Allardyce, I think he had to go there. You know, there's a few new journalists sticking up for him today, saying he, what he did wasn't really wrong. But when you're England manager, you have a certain standard to live up to, and he let that standard down badly uh, by getting involved must have been really badly advised from the two people that he was uh, taken to the meeting with mm -hmm. uh, to talk talk business with these people. Uh, his agent, Mark Curtis, has a track record of, uh, of having trouble with the authorities for breaking rules. He's been fined. I think he's been suspended. And Sam has had a long, long association with that guy. And uh, that hasn't benefited him. Um, uh, in this in this case, uh, so I, I thought he was out of order. I thought when he spoke to those people about uh, some of the players, some of the staff, uh, some of the uh, staff that was involved in the Euro, Roy mm -hmm. Hodgson and Neville, uh, I thought that was totally inappropriate. He referred to England wasting all that money, the FA wasting all that money on building Wembley. I think he had to go. Mm -hmm. I think he had to go. He walked into it. He was very stupid. Uh, but I have no problem with him going. They, they, there will be a problem saying, well, why didn't we know about this guy when we appointed him? Because he has a history of being involved uh, in, in things that are not good for the game. Well, there was the Panorama, Panorama program yeah, in 2006. Ago, he, threatened, yeah. he threatened to sue the BBC. Yeah. Mm. He said they'd all come out and with my lawyers, but he didn't sue anybody. Mm. So, uh, didn't do too much wrong, but he didn't behave properly. Uh, we, we